show, Southern Showcase, Southern Showcase, Southern Showcase, Southern Showcase, Southern Showcase, Southern Showcase. Kick off your shoes. Folks, we're back in your home again for another week of Southern Showcase. Proud to be back in your homes again, and we're live here at Trotters. Uh, if you don't know how to get to Trotters and you want to come out and see the show, be part of the show, if you're coming up from Huntsville, for you folks that's in Huntsville or Ardmore down that way, you just come up the Huntsville Highway, take a ride on a bypass here, and we're right out here on the ride on the hill. And for you folks that watch us every week from Tallahoma, you just come down through Lynchburg, come down to 64, take a left out here on the bypass, we're up here on the hill. So we want everybody to come out and be part of the show. And we're going to talk to our guys tonight because y'all have been doing a lot of writing here lately. You know, the last show or two, we've heard some songs from y'all, some originals that y'all have done. You've got some more in store for us. So tell us what's been going on in the studio, Tony. Well, we really just had a one weekend trip to the studio, but uh, over the last few months, we just decided that uh, we were, you know, been doing cover tunes all these years. Why not try to write some songs well, while we're good. on this show? So we'll we'll play them and. We're going to record them out there at Hutz, and hopefully by January we'll have one with about 11 or 12 songs on it. Well, that's, that's good. So, folks, you got something to look forward to. You know, you got the Concrete Band making their own CD, so, uh, and we, they're down at the Coldwater Studio. The Coldwater Studio is right down there in Coldwater, and James Hudson, the owner operator of the Coldwater Studio, the sound technician, is our guy. He's the one that does the sound that you're hearing every night, so he does a great job with these guys. He does a great job with everybody that goes down there, so. We look forward to having y'all CD, and hey, we look forward to, you know, just y'all showing out for us every week. So, folks, got a great show for you tonight. We got a girl coming here, local girl, beautiful, beautiful hair. Why do you see her hair? It matches my shirt, believe me, it does, it does. Have you, y'all see her before? The, <laughs> and uh, she's got a beautiful voice. She does a lot of benefit stuff. She does a lot of fundraising stuff, and she's real, she's just great. She'll be coming in here in a little while. Her name's Kim Radigan. She'll be here in just a little bit. So we're going to get the show started. We're going to hear, is this another one of y'all's originals? Yeah, Brandon's got a blues song. Spud has got a song that he has wrote? Yeah. All right. Folks, welcome to the show. We're going to get started from the Cane Creek Bullets right here. <laughs> so bad, baby. I have to stop and get my breath. You hurt me so bad, baby. I have to stop and get my breath. thing like you could uh, hurt me so bad take everything I got baby but it still ain't enough to please Go on and take my keys, keys of my 
my brand new car, man. And there she goes. my guitar and head on down the road. To become known in the world of fine jewelry, there is one principle that must be paramount, experience. After 20 years of importing diamonds in the U.S., a seventh generation jeweler is why you'll always find only the finest quality in Sadgees jewelry. Sadgees is your exclusive diamond merchant that lets your love shine, and Sadgees excellence is what you look for in fine jewelry. Sadgees has exquisitely jeweled accents of fine quality rubies, emeralds, and pearls. See Sadgees for your jewelry repair and the best prices in the southeast. There was a time you could walk into your bank and speak directly to the people who make the decisions. But these days, that's hard to find. Decisions are usually made out of town by someone you'll never meet. That's where the Bank of Lincoln County is different. We make our own decisions. The Bank of Lincoln County, Lincoln County's only home-owned and home-operated bank. The Bank of Lincoln County, just like home. The Bank of Lincoln County, member FDIC. And folks, we're back on the show with our guest, Kim Radigan. Kim, glad to have you on the show. Good to be here. You know, I've been trying for a while to get you on the show, but it seemed like you just got to have an opening and got to work you in. So, hey, it worked out. You're, good. You're here. So, yeah. uh, let's, tell us a little bit about Kim Radigan. We want to know who Kim is. Uh, give us a little history. Where was you raised? Where did you, where'd you go to school? Where did you? Uh, I was raised in Flintville and then moved to Fedville and been to Maine. Lived there for a while. Now back here, hopefully to stay. Been to Maine? Yeah, we lived there a few years. Really? But, uh, yeah, it's too cold up there. God, I can imagine. I had to come back. I but, can imagine. Yeah. It's, it's got to be, ooh, it's got to be cold up there. <laughs> but I'm glad you decided to come back home because, you know, we've got all kind of talent like you around here. No place like home. Uh, no, it ain't. No, it ain't. <laughs> uh, listen, uh, I know you do, a, you do a lot of benefits and a lot of things. Mm -hmm. uh, tell us a little about, about some things that you've done to help the community and to help raise um, money for different things. I'm usually in the Fabulous 50 show, you know, that raises mm -hmm. money for the Cancer Society. Um, done just various benefits here and there, singing some weddings, things like that. Um, my band and I have sang in Nashville a, a few times and uh, hope to be doing that again soon, but we've all been so busy lately that it just hadn't worked out for us. So, um, it does take a lot of time. It does, yeah. It does take a lot. And I know you're in the 50 show and you sing in it just about every time and I mean bring the house down. But hey, listen, the best I remember a couple of years ago, you got in a little acting in that too. Yeah, yeah. Was, <laughs> I'm not an actress, but You've yeah, done I did great. the part. <clears throat> yes, you are. You was a great actor. So, uh, I know you brought a couple of buddies with you tonight that's mm -hmm. going to help you out and yep. uh, give us a little idea of what you're going to give us tonight. Well, uh, we thought we'd do two cover songs and maybe one or two of ours if we have time. Um, I brought Dennis and Dwayne Clark with me. They're part of my band, Crossroads, and we'll just see what happens. Okay, folks, Kim's also got a CD out. It's called Kim Redigan and the Crossroads. 
And uh, how can we get a hold of you? Do you have a website or you have a phone number if somebody wanted to buy this? After the, what they hear here tonight, how can we get a hold of her? Uh, Kim at gov-cs.com. Okay. All right. And, folks, you can also write into the Southern Showcase. Uh, get a hold of me. I know her personally. I got straight. I got the red line to her living room, buddy. I can get you a CD. I can call her up and say, hey, Kim, got to have a box of CD. So we're going to get the show started. Uh, what about getting over there and getting set up? And let's just hear what the first one sounds like. All right. Folks, please welcome to the Southern Showcase, Kim Radigan. Great job, Kim. Great job. Thank you. You got a beautiful voice. Thanks. Of course, I've heard it before all around town, so I just wanted to let the people hear how vo what voice you did have. Thank you. You know, I got told earlier that I wore this shirt to match your hair. I think you said that. I know I did. <laughs> <laughs> you got another one we're going to do, right? Yeah. What's the name of this one? This one's called Free, and it's one that we recorded down at Hut Studio, no. and uh, it's, it's one of ours. That's one y'all wrote? Mm -hmm. uh, this is Dennis and Dwayne Clark. Okay. And uh, they've been with me from the start. And the name of the band there is Crossroads. This is this is Dennis, right? Mm -hmm. And this is Dwayne over here. Mm -hmm. Glad to have y'all guys on the show. Thank you. Folks, please welcome to the show one more time. Kim Radigan. Never meant to die, but it turned into a lie. 
so you're free from me. No more moonlight dreams. I hope you're happy now. I know life goes on, and I'm on my own. Free from loving you. Yes, I'm free from loving you. Building or remodeling? See Fayetteville Lumber Supply, this area's pro building supply store that can help you with your project, whether it be cleanup or fix up. Painting with the image paint line makes it go on so easily with outstanding values every day. For tools, Fayetteville Lumber Supply has what you need with Senco Air Tools, Makita, Skill, and Stanley Tools. Fayetteville Lumber is your pro home center for Tanko shingles, railroad cross ties, chain link fencing products, and quick creep ready concrete mix. If you need it, Fayetteville Lumber and Supply has it. I'm Howard Bentley from Howard Bentley Pontiac GMC, Fayetteville, Tennessee. We're confident we can beat anybody's prices. We're so confident that if we aren't able to save you money, we'll give you $20 to pay for your gas just for shopping with us. New Pontiacs and GMCs at unbeatable prices. And by the way, in addition to money saving prices, Howard Bentley's will give you free tires for life. That's Howard Bentley Pontiac GMC, Fayetteville, Tennessee. It's always worth the drive to Howard Bentley. Save you money. And folks, we're back on the show with our guest, Kim Redigan. Kim, uh, you know, we talked earlier when we were at the table talking about the 50s show that you do every year, the fabulous 50s, the Cancer Society show. Uh, are you in it again this year? Yes. Okay, and it's always like the second week in March, folks. And if you've never seen this show, you need to come to Fayetteville and watch it. You can see performers like Kim all night long. And, you know, you can. it's a great show. You can come watch her. And, um, you know, are you going back into the studio? Sometime soon, hopefully. Yeah, so you've we've got, got a lot on. of new songs, um, but we're not exactly sure when. Okay. Well, we got one CD. We want another one. Um, listen, you know, there's a lot of entertainers out there that people really look up to or people try to follow their footsteps and, and things. If there was ever a performer that inspired you to do what you do or take this style of music, who would it be? Martina McBride. Martina, she's great, isn't yeah, she? Yeah, I, I love her. Yeah, she's good. Okay, folks, we're going to let her have a sample. One more shot. See what you got this time. What's this one called? I hope you dance. Hope Leanne Womack. All right, folks, please welcome the show one more time. Kim Radigan. I hope you never lose your sense of wonder. You get your feel to eat, but always keep the hunger. May you never take one single breath for granted And God forbid love ever leave you empty-handed I hope you still feel small when you stand beside the ocean Whenever one door closes, I hope one more opens Promise me that you'll give faith a fighting chance When you get the choice I 
help you never fear those mountains in the distance never settle for the path of the least resistance living might mean taking chances but they're worth taking loving might be a mistake but it's worth making don't let some help it hard leave you bitter when you come close to selling out reconsider give the heavens above more than just a passing glance when you get the choice Hey everybody, we're live here at Trotters on Friday night. This is what's going on every Friday night here at Trotters. They have a, what they call picking and grinning. And uh, they're picking over here now, and these are the ladies that come, a lot of folks come listen to them every Friday night. And uh, what's your name? Melva Mitchell. Now how long have you been coming out here to listen to this? Since August. Since August they've been doing it? Yes. Do you have a better half up there doing this stuff? or? A, or a, yes. Is it called better half or other half? <laughs> <laughs> My better half. You better half. You better say that. I eh? better say that. <laughs> what was your name? Sandy Beavers. Now, do you have a other half up there? I have a better half. You there. have a better half. <laughs> She's good. <laughs> what was your name? Jane Quick. Now, do you have a partner up there? Uh, yes. You can see, I said partner on you, didn't Yeah, you sure did. <laughs> 51 years, that's okay. 51 years? Now listen, can anybody come out here and do this? I mean, can, if anybody thinks they can pick and grin, they just come out, they don't have to be invited or nothing? Just come on out. Just come on out and just jump up there and pick just like you're doing now? Mm -hmm. Everybody does but me. Everybody does but you? <laughs> How did all this come about, Sandy? I mean, just everybody, just Mildred here at Trotter just said, hey, let's do it? Yeah, that's basically what happened. So y'all just show up every Friday night and, and uncase and let's go? See, that's right. Don't, you just, I mean... There's different instruments here, so it doesn't matter. As long as it's bluegrass, you can just come out? As long as it's not electrical. Not electrical? Uh -huh. It can't be electrical. No electrical. See, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I did. You did? <laughs> <laughs> I might want to bring an electrical thing out here and y'all run me off. She nah. dances. You dance? 
Do y'all ever get up here and dance while they're playing? Sometimes. Sometimes? <laughs> you have to be bribed to do that? No. No? <laughs> <laughs> Folks, we want to welcome everybody to come out to Trotters every Friday night. They pick and grin here for about three or four hours. Please come out, enjoy the group, enjoy the meal, go over here and get you something to eat, come over here and listen to this. We're going to get back to the show. See you later. At Acme Paint and Body, we work for you, not the insurance company. And folks, we're back with our guest, Kim, to get her to sign our guitar. You mind signing our guitar? No, not at all. We always get the guests to sign the guitar. We try to, and if it's a big bunch, we get them to sign it after the show. So, uh, You got one more for us? Mm -hmm. Folks, we want to thank Kim again for coming out and being on the show tonight. We've had such a good time, and, and I hope you've had a good time too. Guys, we want to thank have. you, and uh, we look forward to having you back in another CD. All right, okay? thanks. Take us out. Bye-bye, folks. See you next week. Try